Hi there, Maureen from Color Me Positive PLR. Um, just going to do a quick pass through of how to use, how to embed PayHip, your PayHip products into your website. Uh, if you'd like to do that. First, I just wanted to quickly go over the um, logo thing that some people were having problems with. So you would go into your PayHip account, go to store and launch your store builder. Okay, and see here it comes up with um, the home page, basically the collection page. So whichever one you're on here is the one that you're going to be editing, right? So that's my custom page, which is just the contact. Um, so I'm going to go back to all products, okay? And I've just added one product. Now, to change this, you can just click on whatever element you want to work on, and it will go there right so i'm in the header right now so just go to the header section and here it says store logo and i've uploaded my logo here and the only thing you really can do is change the size and there's not much else you can do and i think the biggest it will go is 150 pixels height right so it can be really small medium depending what you want to do with it so i'm just going to leave it at around 120. Very cool uh, and that's pretty much all you can do you can you know like move your contacts around and stuff i'm gonna stay on the page and if you want to just go back you can save the changes right and then go back and play with the navigation links if you want right so you can add a link um i would probably add a link to the blog once i get it up and going on my website they do have a blog on here so i'm not quite sure if i'm going to do one or the other yet but anyway that's just for the um for the logo i just wanted to show you that okay and now i'm going to exit the store builder and i'm going to go to the products here so this is the product i put up and when you want to embed your products you can go to here share embed here you can have a link right just this just a link you can share it on facebook twitter you can have an embed button on your your website right so and you get your embed code here but i want to embed the page of this okay so this is my product so you would copy that now I'm going to come over to my website, and I don't know what you're using, if you've got WordPress or or what, so I can't really help you there. Uh, but this is how I would do it. So this is the page I want the products to be on. And so I'm going to go to Edit Page here. And then what I'm going to do is add, <clears throat> excuse me, three columns. Okay html right i need html so oh first i need to put columns okay so sorry okay so columns and i want three okay so here they are then i'm going to come in this one and i want to add the custom html so I'm going to click on that, and then we're going to paste in that from PayHip, and this is what shows up, okay? And I'm going to do the same for over here, HTML, okay, it's already there. And I'm just going to paste it in again because I only have the one product, and then I'm going to do the same for over here.
Okay, so this is what it's going to look like. So what I might do, right, and I have images there. Instead of having it this, like with the description and everything, if I'm really going to just use this here and not send people over to actually pay hip, what I would probably do, instead of putting all of the, um, the text under here describing it, I would actually create images. So here I've put, I've only got two images, which is over on the site here, right? So if I go in to edit my uh, thing, it, it see these images I've added. So that's what's showing up here, right? So what I might do, and because this is a bit big, and if I have a lot of products, right, it's going to be a little bit uh, long, the page. I guess I could have page two, page three. Um, but what I would do is probably just have the the name, the uh, the price, and the buy now button, and then I would add more images to this. So I might even have an image that has a bit of a description on it, so that way um, it's only as long as this. Okay, uh, but that's up to you. It depends on what your aesthetic is, what you what you have plans for, um, and it's good here. I don't have a blog up yet. Um, but once I did, what I would do is add, like, you could add, um, I'm going to update that. You could add one of these to the sidebar, right? So it, it should adjust to the sidebar. So you could promote one product in your blog post. You could actually put them in there too. So it's, it's pretty cool, actually. Um, I'm still trying to figure out, and I don't think you can just put in the whole pay hip store itself, you know, um, domains, if you want to put in your own domain. Uh, so I'm not quite sure. It would be kind of cool to have just uh, share embed your front page, basically. Uh, so I haven't figured that out, if that's possible yet, from what I'm seeing, not, not really. Um, so anyway, uh, basically that's how you embed stuff, right, into your, your website from PayHip. So you can keep them on your page. They don't go to another page. And when they click on the Buy Now button, PayPal thing, because you're going to hook up your PayPal or Stripe or whatever, and they'll purchase straight from your site so they don't ever have to leave your site. Anyway, I hope this helps.